The following video is of a Red Ball SPK645 self-propelled broadcast hooded retrofit kit that is designed to minimize spray drift. These kits are available for most self-propelled sprayer makes and models. The kit works by installing the original Red Ball Gen 2 broadcast hoods and curtains to a self-propelled boom to reduce the amount of spray that can drift. These spray hoods deliver the best drift protection and consistent coverage when the wind curtains are touching the crop canopy. This inside view shows how the wind has minimal effect on the spray pattern as the nozzle sprays. The spray pattern remains unaffected from the wind giving you improved and consistent coverage. The front view of the boom shows the front wind curtains contacting the crop canopy to form a seal to protect the spray pattern inside the hood. The view from the rear shows the hood curtains also contacting the crop canopy to enclose the spray pattern and help block it from the wind. The spray hoods can also open up the crop canopy to allow the spray to penetrate into the target zone for more consistent coverage. The SPK645 is available in 60 to 80 foot kits and is mounted to the center section and right and left primary sections of the boom. It includes the original Red Ball Gen 2 broadcast hoods mounting brackets and hardware to mount the hood assemblies. The kit and red ball hoods are ideal for spraying along field borders and buffer zones. The secondary section of the boom can also be unfolded to spray the middle of the field when desired. Initial installation of the SPK 645 takes approximately 10 hours. After the initial installation, the hood assemblies can be put on or removed in approximately 10 minutes. To remove the hood assemblies from the boom, disconnect the quick caps with the hose from the sprayer nozzle bodies. Then remove the hitch pin that connects the hood mounting tube into the receiver. Pull off the hood assembly. To install hood assemblies, insert the hood mounting tubes into the receivers, align the holes in the tubes, and insert the hitch pin. For more information on how you can help manage your spray drift, log on to www.wilmerfab.com.